It's Lady Savage. We make real music. Follow me on Twitter at X underscore Lady Savage. YouTube, D Lady Savage. And um, we about to head to the Men Against Domestic Violence Rally. Dear thank you for another unkind mistake, God. Thank you for allowing the message to be conveyed to our hearts and our spirits, Lord. We pray that each individual to the next years in the domestic violence is intolerable. Thank you for allowing us to unify once again in your name, Lord. Amen. 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 Fired up. We are fed up. We're going to man up and we're going to step up. And when we step up, we're going to be bring healing to broken homes. When we step up, we're going to learn the importance of bringing love and peace into these areas. When we man up and step up because we are fired up, we're going to make this world a, a better place, a world of hope and harmony and peace and love. When we man up and step up, we know how to handle pressure without hitting our own teammates. Yo, hey, we headed to the men against domestic violence rally, you know, domestic abuse, you know what I'm saying? We out here at WMRM, team lady said we support, you know what I'm saying? Spreading the message that, you know what I'm saying, fighting on women, domestic violence is no longer acceptable. It's not tolerated. 26 slams last year, 90% of them were women. They were our mothers, our sisters, our daughters, our aunts, our nieces. Boy, y'all gotta stop that, man. No WMRM team, man. Stop the violence. Stop domestic violence. You hitting on your women? Yeah. You're punk and I put WMRM don't play that. Come on. Young boy. Y'all tell them to stop whooping the walk the women's man. It's no no. It's a no go, man. We don't whoop them, we please them. Yeah. It's an amazing day. This is an amazing moment. For about 17 years, I've been working on this issue of having men involved in the prevention of men's violence against women. It's not violence against women, it's men's violence against women. We call it a women's issue. You know what that means? It's their business, it's their responsibility to take care of it. You know what the reality is? It's our issue. We are, we are the perp, we are, hang on, we are the perpetrators. It's our issue. It's going to be known as a city, a culture, where there is zero tolerance for domestic violence. It's a new day in Dallas. When the nation thinks about Dallas, they're going to think about a city, about a culture that says we're not going to have domestic violence. Why? Because in Dallas, the nightmare is over. With my God, not yeah. yours. Right, so you're here supporting the it's rally of domestic violence. What do you think should be the next step in the It's not enough to be just be a nice guy. Okay. It's not enough for us to just not get our lives. And it's not enough, frankly, for us to not shake the hand or play golf with a man that we know to be an abuser. Too many of us are afraid of speaking up or standing up because we don't want to offend anyone. Well, let me tell you what's offensive. What's offensive is a man who would raise his hand to a woman he says he's like. What's offensive is that anyone would love I'm done. I promise you I'm done. But let's make sure that this is not just an exciting moment, but instead a transformational movement. Because when we do that, we won't make the mistake of Zorin Kierkegaard's Duck Church. You remember the Duck Church? In the mythical Duck Kingdom, the ducks came for church. And when they came for church, Pastor Duck preached a three-point sermon. Pastor Duck said, point one, you are ducks. Point two, you have wings. Point three, you can fly. And those ducks ducks were shouting and waving their wings. Preach, Pastor Duck. Then the invitation was given. Several ducks came to unite with Duck Church. Then after church is over, Pastor Duck is shaking wings with all of the ducks as they go out to go home. They said, Pastor Duck, you showed it. Preach. Thank you for telling us we are ducks. Thank you for reminding us we have wings. Thank you for letting us know we can fly. And then they all walked home. I know that we're able to express those emotions to our woman, to our kids, and, and at the end of the day, if there is a confrontation, we walk away. We're still a man, and that makes you more of a man to be able to walk away from confrontations. 